Hello and welcome back to another Tricky Mints video. Today we are on Soul Hunter Simulator. This is a fairly new game. It came out last month. Uh, so I just kind of was searching for all types of games. Like anything that's new, anything that's uh, just recently got added to Roblox or if there's new updates on it. So I've been just kind of looking for just about anything and everything. This was from another sponsored ad. So I figured, why not check it out? It did have Simulator in the title of the game, and I literally never heard of it, so it was probably just hidden away. So this is what your screen would look like if you open up the game. I literally hadn't really moved, so let's see. Welcome, Hunter. You can only carry souls you have. Um, if you have coffin, here you can have this one. All right, so we get a free, like, soul thing I I don't know what the capacity of the souls would be but or like how much actually wait before we do that all right so here we go so this is the donation but we are gonna get these two right here times two soul stones and times two uh, souls that way we can see whether or not if the game passes work on the game so these are giving us 50 they should give us a hundred yep there we go so we're getting a hundred every time whenever we collect it and on top of that it's a times two event that is currently on all right so I think we have to sell right purify your souls and the soul stones here all right yes Alright, and I think this is the chest, so we get a nice little weapon. Ooh, we got a starter store. Ah, uh, hell. Alright, never mind. I was trying to figure out how to like close it, but I figured it out. Oh, we just get souls automatically, we don't actually have to worry about much of anything. So definitely like one of those clicker games. This one also has stuff that you can fight. I'm pretty sure you do uh, take damage if they hit you, which is kind of unique. So initial thoughts on the game. It looks like it'll be a lot of fun if they do add in bosses and all types of stuff. But then again, I've never played the game, so I don't know what's beyond this portal. There might be bosses, there might be new zones, all types of stuff. So let's get a great look around before we start the grind. There's a rest cave. I'm assuming this is the boss area. Oh no, these are the ranks. So, ooh, there's a lot of ranks. I'm going to just slowly count this up. So, adventurer. So this, so we're just at the beginner, or beginner. So one, two, three, oh, just. Let me set my DPU down so I don't go super fast. Right, there we go. So two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten. We just for you, those of you that don't know, I have my finger on the one I counted up to ten. So eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, let's scroll up a little further, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, man there's a lot of ranks, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, Thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine. So thirty-nine ranks total, and that is just absolutely ridiculous. But we are definitely going to focus on maxing out this game. So that'll be the primary goal. But yeah, so. Um, let's just go ahead we are going to attempt to start grinding and hopefully make it 
a few ranks up. So yeah, so I'll see you guys in a few minutes. And we are back. We got all the way up to the darkness rank. Um, I thought ranking up was going to be super easy until this next rank, the soulless. And if you guys can notice the difference in the numbers, it adds on another digit. So I went from having to do 1 million souls up to 11 million. And my current coffin, which I literally just bought a new coffin. Uh, was unable to get up that high like this was my one that I had saved up and bought 
1.5 million. So instead we ended up getting, I think it was, it wasn't that one. Pretty sure it was this one, the next one up. And it can only go up to 1.75 million souls. And the souls is what you need to rank up with. You can't use soul stones or anything like that. So, so currently we are stuck. We need to try and get, I think stage two. Yeah. We need to try and get this one and this one costs 75 million soul stones to get. But overall, it's a pretty good game. I would say definitely play it if you guys have not played it yet. It is, like the first few ranks is pretty easy to get. The la or like the next ones is pretty hard to get. But I do kind of like being a Triceratops. I have spikes in the back. I, to be honest, I'm pretty sure that's the coffin. But the coffin is looking great. But overall, that's um, this game. Uh, let's just try and get two good weapons. I'm hoping for like a legendary thing. Nope. We did not get one of those things, but let's try again. Spin. I'm trying to get an orange. The yellow ones are bad. What the? Uh, did I get a... Hmm. So, ultimate. Alright. I need to reopen this. Uh, for, for some reason it isn't loading up the uh, damage difference. No. Oh, so, yeah, so this is still better. Doing what, 52? Yeah, uh, I, I think it's broken. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's broken. It was doing like 10,000, but now it's not. Oh well, it's a buggy game. Um, definitely has potential. I do plan on maxing out the game whenever I get ch a chance to. I'll figure out the whole damage thing, but for right now, that'll have to do. Hope you guys all enjoyed today's video, and I will see you guys all in the next one. Kip, have a good one.